We don't usually start in the basement for our videos, but this definitely deserves a mention. We are in a penthouse uh, lift lobby, and with this card, you have a private lift lobby going straight to your penthouse. And then into the lift, and with the same card, And we're going straight into the level 14 penthouse apartment. And a fun fact about private lift lobbies is that no other people can have access to your unit. Not even the security guard, not even the management. You need to have the right card to enter. And wow, just look at this. Nice kitchen top, nice dry kitchen. And we are at a fully decked up, fully furnished penthouse, five bedroom penthouse in fact. It is a 1,744 square feet of floor area. And just look at the high ceiling. I think the first thing when I step in and then my eyes are drawn to this uh, hanging pendant lights, it just um, warms up the void space. And high ceilings are like an architectural feature present only in penthouses because that's the highest floor and uh, that's where we can build this kind of space up there. And what I love about this landscape kind of uh, configuration, I call it dining over here and living over there, is that once you slide the doors open, your indoor party now flows through to outdoors and this is where you get your million dollar view overlooking the entire pool and lots of sky right here. And of course, with high ceiling, that means we have plenty of wall space to play around with green feature like this. And this is a natural feature, uh, an artificial one. You just have to dust it and you don't have to water it and things like that. But of course, you can add more plants. You can add more planters over here. Now this is what I call the dry kitchen, where you have a breakfast tabletop uh, for quick breakfast, quick coffee, grab and go, chew and eat, pack your bags, go to school straight. And over here is where all the dirty work happens, all the mess happens, which your guests don't get to see it because this will form your wet kitchen right here. And what I love about newly built projects is that the kitchen has lots of cabinets top and bottom and everything is brand new. Just look at the laminates. Just look at the parts, hinges, lots of storage, uh, overhanging storage, uh, hidden dish racks right here. And no one has used them before. While I appreciate such windows, sliding windows, they brighten up the usual dark kitchens and it allows the hot and cold air to circulate within the kitchen itself. Now, just look at the smack fittings. Smack stove, smack oven. Uh, it just makes you feel like a serious chef in the kitchen whipping up meals. So now, in every private penthouse uh, with a private lift lobby, there will be a back door as a second emergency exit. But I do see this back door as something like where your repairmen can come in, your contractors can come in without going through the front door, right? And the most important thing is, Red Mart comes in. You know, your helper is gonna carry the groceries and put it straight into the fridge. And your helper is gonna love working for you because just look at the space she has here. This is like her own space with bright, airy windows, huge panel windows, and an ensuite bathroom. Just, just look at that. Even my child doesn't stay in, in an ensuite bedroom at all. So this will be the back part of the house where your wet kitchen is. I like how they furnished it with this earthy kind of brown, like grey, white uh, tones 
for the house. And this is the part where I, I call it, I separate the entire penthouse into two sections. Uh, four bedrooms, including the master on my right side, and on the left side will be the junior master, which I'll talk about later. So let's walk this way. This will be your bedroom four. We have kept it empty because uh, there are other possibilities to furnish it up, deck it up. And this will be the common bathroom that will serve the three other bedrooms, which are usually the kids' bedroom. I think it's a beautiful design. I mean, earthy kind of Japanese feel, right? And your child, maybe your favorite child, is gonna love this loft bedroom right here. Just come with me. They get to sit down, do their work with no interruption, good views, good brightness coming in and so this is where I call the study area you have storage storages storage places to put the school bags books you have a little reading corner I call it and what's most important is kids love to climb so they're gonna love climbing up and down the loft where their bunk bed is and they can have parties they can invite their friends over and this is quite a cozy corner. Uh, it's easy to change bed sheets. And then if they were to uh, slip in this direction, they get great views overlooking the entire pool and the open green view and lots of sky right there. And one thing to note is that they have this glass panel over here and, and they can call out to mommy and daddy, oh, dinner is ready. I'm going to have dinner now. And they can just go straight down. They can see what's going on in the living room. And we'll go to the other bedroom right now. This will be the second bedroom. We have kept it uh, sparsely furnished, I call it. And this feels like a lounge area, a study area, a reading area, because with this high lofty feel, you, you do not feel that the room is small, you do not feel claustrophobic, and it, it is just quiet a little further away from the living area. And let me show you the master bedroom right now. And if you do realize the master is on the furthest end of the house, so it's gonna be the quietest room in the penthouse. And then you notice that the master bedroom has a step out balcony for fresh air, for looking out you know you can see that there's just so much sky right here to look out there and what i really like about the master bedroom is you have three and in fact quite large cabinet panels i think the missus is gonna love it just look at this three panels and one more on this side drawers, laminates, fresh, brand new. And speaking about the bathroom, uh, they have designed in a way where uh, everything will be kept hidden, tucked inside your towels, toothbrush, uh, floating water closet, which looks nice and easy to clean. And then you're gonna have lots of space, toothbrush, hair gel, hair wax, everything just goes in and a showering cubicle with a hanging rain shower. Now, let me show you the other side of the penthouse. And if you have guests or even grandparents living with you, this is where they can bunk into. It's like a little corner right here. This is what I call the junior master with its own a uh, powder room. It's a nicely fitted powder room. So, you know, they can use the powder room. There's privacy. It doesn't interrupt the other family on the other side. And this is the junior master I'm talking about. Just look at the big piece of square panel of window, which doesn't cut the view that you look out into. And with a full length floor to ceiling, window it is just going to be bright the whole day and it overlooks the green 
clubhouse right there. Absolute privacy for two different families staying here or even your friends or guests. Now, Grandeur Park residence is uh, located in a very ideal location which I think the residents are going to love the covered linkway which brings you directly to Tanamera Station with just a one minute walk and there is going to be another alternate new line at Bedok South which is the New Thompson Eastern Line and not only that, uh, Bedok Mall is like one MRT station away and we have various schools right here, Bedok View Secondary School opposite us, Tamasic Primary School like 10 minutes away, Red Swastika and the University of Technology and Design are all close by. And within this estate, I mean judging from how big the swimming pool is, you get 90 amazing facilities which I think I need the brochure, they separate it into body, mind and soul. With the body, you get this infinity pool, uh, aqua aerobic pool, reflexology pool, aqua gymnasium and tennis court of course. And under the mind, you get fanciful stuff like Himalayan salt room, spa rooms, therapy corners, waterfall spa and plenty of cabanas, chill out cabana, floating cabana, reading cabana. There is just Lots of things in here that I'm reading out to you right now. And under the soul, you have waterfall terrace, family deck, courtyard deck, chill out lawn, water courtyard, spice garden, barbecue pits, chess garden, maze garden, and plenty of lots of stuff. And one good thing is that it caters for the kids because under the kids club, you have a kids pool, kids gym, kids club, kids water play, forest adventure zone, flower field adventure zone, 90 of them and everything you see right here in the house the finishing the furnitures the outdoor furnitures will be sold together with the entire penthouse so just bring your luggage in and you're ready to move in I hope you love this home tour as much as we do but don't forget to click the like and subscribe button and we're going to bring you more home tours in the next few coming weeks.